Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to take my drill here and this picture and it's going to get hung above this black shelf over here in my breakfast nook. And I'm going to be doing a little bit of decor on the shelf underneath the picture. Oh, I don't know. I don't know if I have the energy, you know. After all that garage cleaning that I did on Monday, I have to tell you, I'm still wiped out. Yes, uh, my mind tells me all the time that I'm in my 20s, but my body says, Jody, what are you doing? You're in your 50s. Even my husband, because I said, when I got done, I was like, oh, my feet and legs are just killing me because I was on my feet for about six hours doing that, just going back and forth everywhere. He's like, why don't you just do that in a couple of days? And I said, if I did try to do it in a span of two days, I said, after the first day, I'm not going to want to go back out there and do it. There's no way. I do this like once a year, but you know what? Maybe I should keep it clean all the time. Yeah, just uh, tough it in the wintertime and go out there and clean a little bit at a time. Maybe I should do that. <laughs> okay, before we get started on the decor over here on the shelf, Let's head over into my living room and I got some boxes delivered the other day that I haven't opened yet and let's go see what's in them. Okay, ready to do some unboxing? Yeah. Promise I'm not. I cut myself. Well, I might. <laughs> Who knows? Yes, I always hold a razor blade like this. Now this is from Craft Outlet. Let's see how surprised I'm gonna be. You know, when you order this stuff a long time ago, you forget. I actually got some Christmas stuff. Yes, I did. Because sometimes from this place, if you don't get it early enough, you can't get it. So got some of these picks here. They're actually poinsettia ones. Let's go ahead and pull them out. Let's see it. Oh, these are kind of pretty. I probably shouldn't be doing glitter right now. Finally got rid of all the glitter. I like these. These are very pretty. Okay, let's see what else we got in here. And I'm actually thinking of doing something with nutcrackers, so I thought this would be cute to get the nutcracker legs. I think that you can bend these, I'm not sure. Let me see. No, you can't bend them, but you can uh, do those a little bit like that. So, got a couple of those, and I also got these nutcracker faces. Now, these are just uh, foam. I think these are really cute. Not sure what I'm gonna do with them. I mean, these are also things that you can put like on a wreath, do something fun with them. Let's see. And I got some of these. I really like these. Oh, I got some yellow ones. Yeah. But I like these cream colored. It's great for any time of year. I like to use. I'll, I'll use them in the fall when I have. Uh, my sunflowers that I used with the off-white. I got a bunch of those. Oh, check this out. These are half trucks. These are things that you uh, like put in a wreath. I thought this was so cute. Looks like this needs to be fixed a little bit, you know. Painted over. I don't know what happened there. Let's see? I like that. I'm going to hang them actually too. I got a green one too. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it green. I thought about painting it white because the white ones were not available anymore. So, possibly. I don't know. I'll have to wait and see. Same thing. I think those are cute. I got a bunch of uh, ribbons. Yeah. I got a couple of those. That. So over here. And it looks like I got two of the green. Okay, I got one of these. And I got two of these. And I got two 
of those. It's great for Christmas time. Like I said, gotta get it now. And these are other things. Uh, these are little metal signs you can get. You can put them inside wreaths or just hang them. I thought these were cute with the rooster and the cow. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them yet. I'll just go in the kitchen. Might go on a wreath. I don't know. And what is this? Oh, this is the actual front part of a truck. I thought this was a cute idea too. Because you can also decorate with this on a tabletop and a vignette and have greenery and stuff or some hay bales back behind and do all kinds of pretty fall foliage around it possibly. Or this is another one and it does hang, as you can see. They show it like inside of a wreath coming out of the middle of the wreath. So I thought this was cute too. All right, so I'm gonna take this box off and we'll get on the next box. Okay, the next box is from Factory Direct Craft Supply. So let's see what surprise is in here. This is a much smaller box. Oh yeah, uh, I'm about the wrong one. <laughs> That's okay. I was trying to get more of the chicken wire ribbon, and I thought I had the right size, but I went much wider, which is okay. I have to see about ordering the smaller width, if they have it. And I thought these were really cute. Uh, this is, get it open, Letter to Santa ribbon. And it just repeats itself. Yeah, but I thought that this was uh, so cute. That was kind of a different way for it to be rolled. But you could uh, put this in your tree. You can. I was thinking about, you know, this would be cute to possibly stiffen it up and use it with one of my big Santas that he hold and we can hold it. I thought that was really cute. I got a, a couple of them because they really weren't that expensive. So I thought it'd be kind of cute. And then, of course, I got a bunch of buttons. I, I love buttons. I love all these buttons. I like to decorate with them. And these are my Christmas colors. So, like I said, I was getting a few Christmas things for you. Came in. When you order from the factory direct craft, they always give you a free gift. <laughs> it's always beads, it seems like. I'm not sure what I would do with this color beads, but that's it. And I got one more box over there. I'm going to... Move this and go get that box. All right, well, this one is self-explanatory. It says potting shed. <laughs> Fine. So I got this from Decor Steels. And I really love to work from that place. Sometimes I unfortunately don't have, like, an, my email that this one goes to on my phone. So I don't get notifications right away. I have to check my email all the time on my computer to catch the great deals that you get. And most of the time they're gone. Every time I'm looking at it, they go, some go really, really fast. And I thought this was so cute. And I'll have to go back and see how much this was. I can't remember. But I love it. it's metal. And I'm thinking about putting it on my side porch here on that old window that I have, because I want to put that one table over there, paint it, take, it's, it's blue right now, and I want to make it white and make more of a potting table over there. So that is it for my unboxing of my surprises. Okay, the first thing is I'm gonna put this glass face on there. I like how this has the honeycomb pattern to it. I just added a little bit of the faux greenery and we're going to set that there then I'm going to put some more greenery right here and I'm going to tuck in a sunflower, a sunflower like that. okay now we're going to kind of mimic it on the other side with a, a smaller face Now I'm going to put this glass face up 
Now it does coordinate because they have the same holder even though the design is different. And we'll set that one. And this end, I'm going to move it a little bit further. Put a little bit of greenery around it. Then I will put another sunflower in here. I'll tuck it in over here on this side. Okay, now I need something in the middle. And I want to do something with a B. And this is the only thing I could find is my big metal B. So we're going to stick that in the middle. I think that this will look cute. Okay. All right, I think that that is going to do it. So I'll get some close-ups of it so you can see the way it looks with the picture above. Well, I really love how the shelf turned out. Now, I wasn't too sure about using the glass vases in the metal containers, but I think it ties in with that picture perfectly. And by the way, that picture I got at Amazon last year, and I have the coordinating one that matches over on my other wall of the breakfast nook. And you'll get to see all that when I do some revamping. I'll probably be doing a bee tablescape too, because I have some newer bee dishes that I got last year that I didn't use. So I will be showing those on the table and that will all coordinate in here. And I did take all the lemons out of my kitchen. So I want to add some sunflowers in and maybe that big rooster that I got at the thrift store. I think I'm going to get rid of my three tier tray and put him there instead with some sunflowers, I think is what I'm going to do. So I hope everybody enjoyed the video today and that I could give you some ideas how to decorate a shelf in your home. I want to wish everybody a very wonderful day, and I hope that everybody will stay positive, stay safe, and stay healthy. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.